yeah, just finished painting and we are going to, to mix the anti-graffiti coating right now. No one's starting right over there. Going. Mike's got a speech <laughs> Let's get this right here. Okay, start from the bottom. And Mike, super awesome coolness. Dr. Trotter showed up today. And he walked up and he said, hey, I'm in there. You made it look like me. And I guess he was amazed because he never came and posed. But, um, and I didn't really know what he looked like, but I think I did. And he was happy with it. It helps that it has a mask on. And, but the thing that's really, really astonishing about today, it's just amazing. This was, could have been foreseen, but I didn't foresee it. It's Veterans Day, right? It's the 11th day of the 11th month, and as Phil um, informed me, the armistice was signed in, on the 11th hour, which is 11 a.m., and we were talking about it this morning at 11. And it just happened that on this day and yesterday, I was painting the veterans, which you could, the 101st portrait in the mural is Stephen Brunton from Ukiah who was in the Navy, but he was in the um, Brown River Navy. Is that right, Phil? Brown Water. Brown Water Navy, which is the, um, the people, and here's a picture of the type of boats that in the Mekong Delta, the highways were the rivers. Mm -hmm. And so to transport goods and troops, they had to use boats. And of course the um, Vietnamese used boats too. So mm -hmm. he was a leader in one of these boats, and that's how he was killed. He's taking troops, and he kept on going. Yeah, and that's just a sketch down there, but the boats will be there. Mm -hmm. And they came under fire, and he kept on going, and he was killed, but the, the convoy of the lead boat and the, the bigger boats that had troops with sort of like armor protecting them, they made it through. And so this is, him and I'm painting him on Veterans Day and then mm -hmm. a lady happened by today and I always ask everyone did you graduate Ukiah High you know are you from here do you know any of these people and I said let me just ask if you know him because I'd love to know if he has family in the area and she went to school with his brothers she knew them oh Dave God. knows them My. so I hope we can get in touch with his brothers and I'm pretty sure that we can to let them know Stephen Brunton. Yeah. And his brother's names are John and Dave. Yes, John lives in Alaska and Dave Brunton lives in Martinez. And I, I learned, she, she knew this, but we knew about the fact that down in San Diego at the U.S. Naval Training mm -hmm. Station, they dedicated a hall to him. Mm -hmm. And the brothers went down there to that hall last year. I learned from this lady who happened to stop by today. Wow. Isn't that cool? That is. So wow. I'm honored to be painting um, these men. Yeah, All right, so, um, and I'll do my part, right? I do the, the cracks and, yeah. and if, let's see. I can go. Brr. <laughs> yeah. It's really cold out. And especially here in the North Wall. And here I am coding John Hill and his wife, Rita, and Martha, a local lady who amazingly had the you know strength and ability to 
lead her her entire life being in this wheelchair and lead her life and have kids and raise them in the wheelchair. Mr. John Hill used to work at the theater for a really long time, doing, I think, a wide range of jobs, including publicity, going around Ukiah in, in a vehicle with a loudspeaker telling people what movie was playing. Hmm. Right? Isn't that cool? What an awesome way to advertise. Hmm. To grab this. And we should um, also, you could zoom in on the bottle and show the video what the product is that we can use it. Oh, good idea. Really well. We haven't had cause to truly test it, but it makes the surface really slick and easy to clean. And shiny, which I'm gonna get a yeah, clearer. Yeah, not, not too shiny, like it's, it's a modest shine, which is good. <clears throat> um, and it also deepens the pencil when I do that, which is really good. This pencil's so light. All right. John and Rita are protected and marks up. Like a child. All right.